The first B-21 stealth bomber will roll out of its California factory in early 2022 and make its first flight a few months later. The second, non-flying test model is also in assembly. Contracts should be coming soon for constructing hangars and maintenance facilities at operating bases. Ellsworth Air Force Base, SD-1 of the bases expected to host the Raider once it reaches the force. The U.S. Air Force has already begun phasing out its venerable supersonic but conventionally armed B-1B bombers to make room for the super-stealthy B-21 Raiders, but the first B-21 test models are still at least a year from production. Still, the first B-21 bomber is starting to take shape, and more details about it are beginning to emerge. Illustrations shared of the Batwing aircraft show the B-21 to be superficially similar to, though smaller than, the larger and older B-2 Spirit stealth bomber. Critically though, the B-21 is expected to be far stealthier, employing low observable technology at least two generations more advanced than the B-2. The first flight was originally planned for December of this year, though there have long been concerns that this could get pushed back, and earlier this year it was confirmed the Air Force now expects the rollout of the aircraft in early 2022. It would then make its first flight in the middle of the same year. In the meantime, the Air Force has not said what exactly it will be doing with the two brand new B-21s, but there will surely be extensive ground tests as well as simulations. The Northrop Grumman B-21 Raider is an American heavy bomber under development for the United States Air Force USAF, by Northrop Grumman. As part of the Long Range Strike Bomber Program LRSP, it is to be an advanced, very long-range, large, heavy payload stealth intercontinental strategic bomber for the USAF, able to deliver conventional and thermonuclear weapons.